Well, that's probably a bad omen right there. Yep, we're good. And look at all the bullet holes. And that is a tiny little shotgun shell right there. Several bullets there, or casings at least. Flying directly overhead, three helicopters. It might be a military helicopter and they're flying really low. We're not too far away from Area 51. It's uh, tripping me out just a little bit. He definitely knows that we're here. I went all the way, way out of range, right? Turned around and flew directly overhead again. I think that might be the same one circling. All right, it seems to be flying away again. Although I don't know for how long. He seems to be flying right next to me. So, I'm figuring if for some weird reason they really cared about us, they probably would have actually sent people out to find us already. So I'm gonna go take a look at this big pipe and what's inside of it. And then we'll check out the rest of these buildings. And then probably take off here. Look how big that is. You see the mammoth gears here on the side, or the one single gear, which probably would have been used to turn it. So I think it's kind of a massive agitator is what it seems to be. Look at this, this is really amazing. It's made almost like there's little bricking or bricks along the wall. Oh, and there's a bird there. <laughs> and then it's like a fine dust. I don't know exactly what it is. But it looks incredible. Seriously, how cool is this? But it looks like just a powdered cement from when they would uh, churn it up in here. Or like I said, maybe it was to sort of break up larger rocks into smaller rocks or separate the larger rocks from the uh, smaller lot rocks. But uh, again, if you know, make sure to let me know in the comment section. It's a little electric building straight out that way. I want to go check that out here in just a second, but I don't know what that is over there. Looks like part of a tent right there. So somebody's probably been trying to camp out here at some point, potentially for partying. I'd say most likely for partying, but I think I'm gonna wait for just a second here and head out that way maybe with Xavier because it looks like there could be someone standing over there in the doorway and I'm definitely not going to run into people absolutely by myself. <laughs> and like I say always, in places like this, it's so important to look down. This is almost a sheer drop off right here about not too much five or six feet but it could cause some serious damage and broken bones here's another dangerous one here just an open pit and again it doesn't go down very far but it can be incredibly dangerous Let's see if there's anybody back 
Probably not the safest thing to do, or the smartest thing to do. <laughs> right, but... Well, we're gonna go check yeah. It. Hey Royal, um, kind of, uh, you're a little late, but it's okay, um, we are live, for those of you guys who do not know, and I really appreciate the sub count on the, uh, like video guys, um, you guys, <laughs> we all have your back, thank you, maybe you guys can, uh, help us wrestle this guy from there, so we're gonna go. see this, see the sides open over here, yeah, this wall, there's no wall, and I don't see anybody in there. Is that where you saw him? Yeah, I think it was whatever that little black thing is right on the side there. Alright, let's go. Because it just looked like maybe it's a painting of a person. Alright, shout out time before we leave, guys. I got Papa. Who's a shout out? If you want a shout out, write shout out in the comments. I'll give you a shout out, guys. Anybody who's interested in following more of the photos we take of the locations we're going to be in, follow me on Twitter and on Instagram. Instagram Cryptid Hunter. You're going to have to find my photo because there's a uh, fake Cryptid Hunter out there. Who unfortunately, took the name before I did. And on Twitter is Cryptid Hunter NV, like Nevada. Follow me or two guys. Is this where you saw him? Yeah, it was. I think. What was that? Something metal over. It was no, that's like a. Oh. What is it? I don't know. It sounds it's like, like a, a scream or something. Almost. It's like a dog. Like a dog or something, like a muffled bark. What the? F There's nothing here, bro. All right, wait. Pause from here. Huh? Is it coming from there? Where is that coming from, dude? What is it? There is a bark or a muffled. Yeah, it's coming from like an underground. It sounds underground too. There's nothing on there, dude. It's all blocked. Wait. There's nothing right there. It's still going. Is that where it's coming from? I don't know. That goes down a long ways. Look at the holes in these walls. It's like huge bullets have hit it. You can see the smaller shell casings right here. I don't know if those are 9mm or what they are. So many bullets have been fired in this location. Probably more than any location I've ever explored before. This is incredible. You can see that they've destroyed all these ceramic parts. And I think they're used for electrical wiring. Look how huge this thing is, guys. And you can see the ceramic pieces right up there. And they have fallen down and crashed here. But it looks just epic here. so much porcelain I believe it is or ceramic I'm not sure what this box is either the hills look so creepy and there's these Strange noises all the time. Look at that. It has some burn marks. You keep hearing noises from that way. There's a big drop off right over here. I don't know if it's an old creek bed or what it is. There's another big drop off right over to the side. Doesn't look like there's anything in here except for this little piece of fencing right here. I absolutely love this thing. I don't know exactly what it is, if it's like a substation or what its purpose was, but it looks 
so incredible out here in the middle of the desert like this. So I really hope that you guys have been enjoying this episode. Make sure you check out all the still photos that will be over on Instagram. Make sure you check out Xavier's channel, Cryptid Hunter, on YouTube as well as on Instagram and other uh, platforms as well, Twitter and uh, yeah, make sure you give a follow over there. They're going to be having tons and tons of photos up over the next few days and weeks of the uh, whole western trip I've been doing, and especially a lot of these amazing explorers out in the Nevada desert. No, I missed Dude, that. That was loud as hell. I don't know what this is. This is really tiny. Oh, it's completely open. It's got tons of whatever these are. If you guys know, leave it in the comments. It's kind of creepy. everybody thanks for watching this uh, recent episode of 539 productions again thanks so much to my friend Xavier here from the cryptid hunter channel make sure to check in the description below for the link to his channel make sure to subscribe and turn your notifications on because he makes some absolutely amazing videos so you guys are gonna want to check them out so thanks for taking me to all these amazing places man. Ahead, and I will uh, see all of you guys in the next adventure later guys